Why do you think women are so attached to the fitness and going to the gym and using all of the dumbbells and working because one of your videos triggered me and I'm thinking like why why would you lift such a heavy weight like oh a gosh, lot of women do that topic. like yeah like why would women do that so I get my arms get very strong from that but um yeah, I don't know. It's interesting that you say it, it's triggering. It's almost triggering to me too when I see other girls lifting weights because like mm. I feel like it looks painful and it looks uncomfortable. Yeah. And and I'm, and then now hearing you say that yeah. my weightlifting video was triggering to you, I'm actually so fascinated by that. Like <laughs> you just, so how how is it then? Because I do think fitness is just a huge thing. It's just, it's just girls lifting weights and going to Pilates and having these abs and being like just super fit um it's a lifestyle that's really popular right now i know and i see that kardashians uh -huh. have huge role into it it's uh -huh. not just fitness but it's also plastic surgeries oh yeah well they have these huge yeah. fake yeah. fake butts and mm -hmm. these fake hips and fake boobs and but also a lot of uh, celebrities are into fitness but yeah a, a soft feminine woman, mm -hmm. I believe that gyms are for masculine men and for men that in general. Are for masculine men? Uh, for oh, men. Gyms, gyms oh, okay. are for men because seeing women lifting weights is just so unnatural. Because I get that right now we have magazines and all the celebrities with their perfect bodies. Mm -hmm. But if a man, mm -hmm. a masculine man, mm -hmm. had to choose between this perfect woman who is in her masculine energy mm -hmm. but a feminine woman that is maybe 10 pounds overweight mm -hmm. guess who he would choose mm -hmm. do you get that yeah. and so women have to detach from this perfectionism mm -hmm. i used to try to keep up with this but the more i start shifting to femininity by the way i do yoga as well after yeah. meditation i forgot to mention but all of this weight lifts when i stop doing it and I used to do that maybe 15 years ago. Wow. It was such a relief wow. to just fully surrender and accept my body. Yeah. And of course, after being a mom, you cannot keep up with yeah. the same weight. And I'm like, okay, I'm just eating healthy. Yeah. I do what I can, but I'm, I get that I'm not gonna be size four anymore. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know what, fitness is just, it's so popular. So what, like you still, you're running, you're doing yoga, you're eating healthy and you, you look great. So like, what is the... Again, I think women, especially in their 20s and 30s, what I recommend feminine women, the dancing, mm -hmm. the walking, the running, the hiking, yeah. things outside of favorite. the gym. Those are my favorite things Not, Otherwise, do. we're moving from box to box uh -huh. and everything in the gym, those yeah. machineries, it's again subconsciously it's like I'm not good enough yeah I gotta get to this perfection to this body yeah. how Joneses look like uh -huh. and we just gotta let go because I say to a feminine woman how to stay in femininity is through spirituality and how is it through spirituality either meditation prayer or affirmation mm -hmm. being on the nature is number two mm -hmm. because people are running or walking with their uh, AirPods. AirPods. No, you gotta listen to the birds. Oh. You gotta listen to the wind and connect to the nature. Mm -hmm. Look at the sky. Look at the birds. Mm -hmm. Hear the trees moving. Mm -hmm. This is the second way to continue to stay in the feminine flow. Mm -hmm. And number three, staying connected to feminine women, which are only 10%. Especially in the United States. Mm -hmm. If you go to India, mm -hmm. if you go to Middle East, if you go to Africa, there's much more. Mm -hmm. But in the Western Europe, especially in the United States, there's probably around only 10% of feminine women. And feminine women, again, are not attached to the results. Mm -hmm. Results uh, in, the, in the body, finances, career, success, mm -hmm. things like that. Yeah. Detaching. The more you're detaching, the more you're surrendering, the more you're in acceptance. Mm -hmm. And through spiritual practices, you get to the acceptance. Mm. Mm. And flowing. That's so what I have is... It's perfect. Yes, I'm in my age and I accept my body. Perfect it is. See, that know? sounds very intriguing yeah. to me. Yeah. But if a guy that I was dating yeah. was like, I just want to surrender and accept how my no, body no, no. will look, I would no. hate that. Yes, because it's a feminine energy. <laughs> it's it's Yes, it's a feminine flaw. <laughs> but for a man, 
he has to go to the gym because he needs his endorphins. He needs to protect you in case if something happens. It's a very masculine mm -hmm. to go to the gym or run or mm -hmm. weight lift. When my husband is in the gym, I'm doing my yoga and he does mm -hmm. his weights. I'm like, oh, great. I yeah. love it. Yeah. It's sexy, yeah. you know, mm -hmm. when a man can uh, lift the car, you know, yeah. change the tire. Yeah. It's awesome. Yeah. But for us, you know, it's a different energy because we're again shifting to that masculine yeah, and masculine. there's that's why there's duties a woman does the curtains design cooks clean dishes and a man changes the oil mm -hmm. if he needs to care the toilet because you bought a new toilet or a bathtub upstairs that's his duty or taking a heavy trash out otherwise everything is washed off what women are doing and what men are doing is now <laughs> It's very unclear. Yeah. It's very confused. And that's why I see all of these women are lifting weights and I'm like, this looks very unnatural. Well, that's, that's powerful. I, um, I, I, I want to be there, but I, I'm also attached. To yeah. The... I remember in my early 30s when I stopped going to the gym mm -hmm. and I just focused on eating healthy. Mm -hmm. Because I've lost some weight by just eating healthy, all of my muscle and their form was just perfect mm -hmm. without putting all of this energy and mm -hmm. working out. And I was so exhausted doing this exercise because yeah. right now I'm running, but it's very slow. Yeah. It's just for me to get hot in order to mm -hmm. get into the cold, cold water. Wow. I don't have this attachment to how my body should look like. That's amazing. And That's if I'm, really beautiful. I mean, I commend yeah. you for that. I, yeah. I, that would be like a next level thing for me if I could let go of that attachment, but I'm not sure if, um, yeah. yeah, I'm not sure if I feel. Not yet. Yeah. Not yeah. yet. And it's but okay. Eventually. Yeah. 